Hey, welcome back everybody. Today we tackle the faux McRib. I did the first McRib review of the Dollar Tree sandwich. Everybody said you got to try the Encore uh, boneless rib patties, which I got right here, two and a half bucks. I also got pickles, onions, and barbecue sauce and torpedo rolls. Here's what the uh, McDonald's one looks like. Let's see if we can make a copy. All right, so the Encore, we're going to throw these in the oven, 375 degrees. 45 to 50 minutes. So instead of microwaving them, we're gonna take it old school and hit them up in the oven. Here we go. Here we go, take it out of the box. That's what it looks like. It looks like your typical TV dinner. It says remove film, place on cookie sheet in center of the oven. It smells very uh, barbecue-y. And she goes. All right, so here's the Encore out of the oven, McRibs. It smells pretty good. It's a little runny, but it smells good. All right, let's build a sandwich. So I got a toasted bun. I couldn't find a McDonald's bun. I'm thinking my bun's a little big. I may need another half a McRib. A little pickle, pickle McRib action, and some onions. So that looks pretty dang close, I would say. All right, there you have it. That looks as good as a McDonald's McRib. The only thing I didn't get is that bun with the uh, cornmeal that they have. But I don't know, that looks pretty close. What do you think? good. All right, here we go with the taste test. McRib 2.0. That's extremely close to McDonald's. The only thing I would add is a little extra sauce, a little extra barbecue sauce. The pork rib lid thing, it's like a mashed pork kind of pressed patty, I would say, but it's actually pretty good. Tell you what, we did six of these for under five bucks. Not a bad family meal. There you go, Encore McRib, winner. Thanks for watching everyone. Don't forget to smash that like button and do me a solid by hitting the subscribe. See you next time.